I've officially added skirts back into my wardrobe of all dresses. Now there's just one problem. How am I going to organize them in my wardrobe? Welcome back ladies. Today I'm excited to share how I am organizing my wardrobe when I'm adding skirts to the mix. So for this whole time now, I have been wearing all dresses, but I do have a couple of skirts that I'm going to share with you of, uh, you know, my new color story this month for March. I'm adding green into the mix. We are transitioning from winter into spring now. So I wanted to have the colors that just made me feel best in this time. It was definitely inspired by my romance stationery series that I have coming out. And I'm also going to be putting this in on uh, several life books that will be for the academic calendars that I have coming out soon. So if you like your year to start in the middle of the year, then you will um, especially appreciate these calendars. So anyway, we are going to talk about organizing skirts with dresses. Now there are a few different ways that you can do this, but because I am going with a color story, I really wanted to pair the outfits together that I'm going to be using, but I didn't want to have the pant hanger or the skirt hanger up on the same level as just the other hangers that I have. I just, there's something about having a nice flow to it that really mattered to me. So I am pairing the outfits that I plan on wearing together with the tops. And so this is how I have them organized. And I don't have the little, little extra hook that I know is available. I saw them on Amazon actually. I don't have those yet, but I may just end up getting them because they are so cute and pretty and they would be perfect, a perfect fit for trying to incorporate skirts into my wardrobe. But what I did end up doing was using a hair tie, just a clear plastic hair tie, a hair band on the rod and I just looped it through and then put, you know, the, um, the skirt hanger on there as well. So this made it lay flat because there, it does not have a swivel hook on it. So this just makes it lie flat and then everything just looks right. I have added white blush and then a few shades of green, some sage, some darker green, and then I also have something blue within this color story today. So what I've noticed with last month's color story was that I tired of it after maybe two and a half weeks. No, I, maybe I made it to three weeks, but then I was ready to start thinking about what other color story I would be using. So I'm not sitting here saying to just, you know, go with a certain color scheme just for a whole month. Maybe you want to split that month and, you know, just do a couple of weeks of one color story and then switching things out for a new one. And this is like a capsule wardrobe just, you know, within these months. And it makes shopping your own wardrobe really exciting and not to feel like you're always wanting to add something new to that, you know, to what you already have. Now I did add a couple of new things to my wardrobe. Um, this is a new purchase and then I also purchased it in navy. So if you are looking for a skirt suit, please head over to my Poshmark closet. I have a couple of different sizes available for you. And I found this to be the perfect addition to my wardrobe because this time last year, I was in search of something more business-like because my dad invited me to an award ceremony that he was going to receive an award for. And that was the dress code, dress business. It was like business dressy or something. I don't know the exact term right now, but 
I really felt out of place. I didn't feel like the dresses that I wore on a daily basis and even my really dressy ones, it just didn't feel right with the setting, I would say. So ever since then, I had been on the search for something that would you know, make me feel more comfortable in that setting. So this, I would say, this skirt suit definitely fits that whole vibe that I was going for. So sometimes making sure that we are looking for those pieces, um, that we're looking for the things that would make us feel comfortable in all these different settings, we can have that list going, but we are going to make sure that we are going to wait for that right you know that right piece or that right thing we're not just going to run out and just get the first thing that comes our way so this has been on my mind for a while i actually found the navy one first and i had just been to a funeral and i do have something that i'm pretty comfortable wearing to a funeral and it's my navy trench coat it's a flare trench coat it feels like a dress but it's kind of you know um more business like i guess but it's still like i still wanted something where i could feel appropriate at a business event as well as um, a funeral so that has been in that place for this time but now that i have this skirt suit i feel like that would be perfect for that occasion as well so we have different occasions that we may need to dress differently for that aren't what we would normally wear on a day-to-day -day basis. So making sure that we have the right things for those occasions really puts our mind at ease. This other skirt that I have, which is more of a flare style, I would like something that has maybe a sleeve to it and maybe something a little bit more fitted for that kind of style of skirt. So it's fun to start adding these different pieces into my wardrobe. Um, I'm still very much a dresses lady, but um, it's nice to have some options. But one of the reasons why I took the skirts completely out and all of the blouses out of my wardrobe and, um, to begin with was because I wanted to really simplify my choices. But that was also a time where I had my wardrobe stuffed with everything that I had for that season. So one of the things that I have been doing now is just choosing certain colors to wear within a given month. And then it just, that's what simplifies things for me now. And um, adding skirts back in has been um, fun to think about, fun to work toward. I really haven't done it up until this point now, but I have been purchasing a few here and there just, you know, when I see something that I like. Um, but I'm also trying to look for the right blouses or the right tops to give that silhouette that I have been thinking about, that I've had on my mind. Um, I haven't found, you know, the right blouse for every skirt that I have just yet, but we're a work in progress. So sometimes it's just about waiting for those right pieces. Don't be in a big rush, but this is how I would organize these together. I do think that maybe having a drawer for maybe some of the tops that you have or some of the blouses, that would be good too, especially if, um, you have a lot right now i don't really have a lot and i am just going with um, more of the basic the white whitish cream color i think that that's pretty universal and would fit well with you know the skirts that i have so that's really all that i'm looking at right now but it just makes um organizing my wardrobe feel nice like everything looks nice together and then next month we can focus on the colors that i will be bringing in then but this has been fun to do please let me know in the comments below if you have skirts and blouses and tops how do you choose to organize yours and maybe this gave you a new idea on what to do with them especially if you like to see you know all of the same hangers across for instance so thank you so much for being here with me today. I really hope that this video inspired you in some way, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video.